ground control to Mage Tom. Mage Tom, we are gonna stop in Arthur, our first destination, to pick up some cash for the firewood. Just FYI, over. It has been a while since we got on a trip. Uh, for those following us on the other socials, you'll know that we tried to go uh, to a Highland cow farm about a month ago, a, f a few weeks to a month ago, and we were hit with a tornado in Ontario. So crazy. So that trip got cancelled. We are on our way to Killarney Provincial Park today. Of course, my co-pilot, Tia, right here. Um, and something already has gone wrong. We forgot half the food. Yep. Anyways, Killarney Provincial Park today. Uh, we're going with my brother and his girlfriend. Uh, I don't really know what we are going to get up to for today, but we will be hiking the crack again. It is a fantastic hike, and uh, if you guys are interested in seeing what that looks like, check this out. We uh, we went on it on our cross country road trip a year ago, almost a year ago, uh, and uh, we loved it. We're going again this time. It is one of the, our, our favorite parks, so stay tuned. There's going to be a lot of things to see and do. We've just pulled into Killarney Provincial Park. The um, office to check in and to buy firewood is literally right after you turn in. They've got ample parking here for you to park. You gotta head in, we're gonna give them our license plate, tell them we're here to check into our site, and then we're gonna head over there to set up. We finally got our campsite set up here. We snagged a really, really awesome campsite, all thanks to Camp Nab. If you don't know what Camp Nab is, check out our video about it. Um, but quick lowdown, it basically helps you find sold out or completely booked campsites at campgrounds. Um, and so what happens is when you get your account, you do your set up your searches, and then as cancellations happen, it gives you notifications so you can go on and quickly book those sites. So 
This was a Camp Knob Steel, and it is one of the nicest sites that we've had in a while. It is definitely the nicest site we've had here at Killarney Provincial Park. Take a look. We've got our tent because we're here as a bigger group. We also, of course, brought Vansky. We've got our kitchen tent. And then take a look at this view. Now I'm not talking about Andy. <laughs> All right, it's starting to rain. All right, Joanna, what is going on right now? That means new camping recipe coming your way. We have never done Korean barbecue at camping. Joanna had a great idea to do Korean barbecue at camping. My idea. We're not gonna give Andy the credit. We're gonna give Joanna the credit. We are doing Korean barbecue at camping. All right, so we actually, um, <laughs> we actually had pork belly to have as part of our Korean barbecue. Right, Joanna? Yes. We had really, Joanna picked out like really, really good pork belly. We got an hour away from the house and Joanna messaged us on the walkie talkie and was like, did anybody pack the second cooler? <laughs> Nobody packed the second cooler. So we had to go to the grocery store. We could not find pork belly. We settled for pork chops. Master Chef has decided that we are done with the meat cooking, at least for round one. And now we are going to put these mushroom caps on there. Yeah. And what are we doing with it? We're just cooking it in the pork fat. Ah. So the mushrooms are still cooking, but we have some Korean samgyeopsal.
All right, give us the review. How is it? Have fun. <laughs>